Hello guys, I hope you are all doing well. In this video, I'll show you how to solve the problem lead code boats to save people. So let's get started. The problem is that they give you an array of people and an integer called limit. So the input array is an array of people weight and each boat can carry a maximum weight of limit. So each boat carries at most two people at the same time. And also the sum of the weight of those people is at most limit. So the task here is to return the minimum number of boats to carry every given person so based on those information we can build our solution so the first thing is that the maximum of people a boat can carry is two person and every individual person has a weight lower than or equal to the limit so let's take an example let's say we have two person the first person weight one and the second person weight two and the limit of the boat is three so, so what, what is, is the, the minimum number of boats to carry every person so the answer will be one since one boat with limit three can carry the total of of the two person weight so let's take another example so let's say the input is this array of weight and the limit of the boat is three so the answer will be three the first boat will carry the person with weight three and the second boat will carry the person with weight one and two and the third boat will carry the person with the weight so to solve this problem we're gonna use the two pointers technique but before that we need to sort the array because the two pointers technique require the array to be sorted so let's take an example so that you can see how the two pointers gonna work so let's say we have this input array and limit of three so after we sort the array we will have all the smaller numbers to the left and all the larger number to the right then we're gonna use that as advantage to put the lightest person and the heaviest person in the same boat by setting the left pointer at at the start of the array and the right pointer at the last weight in the array and we set an output or variable that's gonna keep counting how many boats we'll need at the end so here we have the first person weight one and the last person weight three means the total weight will be four which is bigger than the limit of what the boat can carry so as we know from the details that it's impossible that we will have a number bigger than the limit inside the array and after sorting the array we will have the larger number at the right pointer so if the sum of the value at the left pointer and the value at the right pointer is bigger than the limit, we're going to put only the person at the right pointer inside one boat. And we're going to eliminate this person by moving the right pointer to the previous weight or number. So here we will have a total of three, which is equal to three, means the two person can travel on one boat. So we're going to add one boat means we're going to increment the both by one and we eliminate the two person by moving the left to the next number and the right pointer to the previous number. So here the left pointer and the right pointer are going to meet each others. And that means we only have one person left and this person can travel lonely and one boat. So we add another boat and by the end we'll have three boats that's it guys so the time complexity for the solution is all fan login because we have sorted the array and as we know sorting take all fan login in complexity analysis we drop the less significant term which is all fan of the loop and the space complexity is off one since we are not allocating any additional memory that's it guys so let's jump at coding the solution the first thing we need to do is to sort the array then we initialize the two pointers left at the first value in the sorted array and the right pointer at the last number in the sorted array and we initialize another variable which is going to be the output variable boats and set his value to be zero then we use the two pointers to loop throughout the sorted array while the start is less or equal to the right pointer we set an if statement if the left pointer meets the right pointer we increment the both by one and we break the loop otherwise we check if the number at the left position plus the right pointer is less or equal equal than the limit integer we increment the both variable by one and we increase the left by one and we decrease the right by one else if the sum is bigger than the limit integer we increment the both by one and we decrease the right by one finally we return the both variable thanks for watching see you in the next video